Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I'm D, and I'm here with another video. So guys, let me first say thank you so much for joining me. Um, thanks to all of my subscribers. If you have not subscribed, please um, please consider subscribing to my channel. Um, and I hope that you enjoy it over here. We like to have lots of fun and talk about handbags. So if there's something you're interested in, keep watching and hopefully um, you'll enjoy what I have going on over here. If you are new, welcome and I appreciate you. So without further ado, let's get into this beautiful handbag. So guys, I have been carrying this bag all week and I absolutely love it. I absolutely love it. There are some things, and I will go over it, um, just a couple of things that I noticed, and I'm pointing them out because I want you guys to know the real, real about this handbag. Um, you know, you may want to pick it up, and I don't want you to be like, you know, she didn't mention that, or she didn't say this, and whatever. So I want you to um, really get the real on the bag. But I absolutely love it, and it will remain in my collection um, as you guys probably know from seeing uh, past videos, I absolutely love the Tan Rust collection from Coach. This is a boutique bag. Um, it is the Lori shoulder bag. So it's a lot going on in this bag that I love. I love shoulder bags. Um, so carrying this bag, um, I did really get to know the bag. Okay, purpose of carrying it. So I did decide to do my coach um, butterfly charm. I was torn between doing that in my flower and I chose the um, butterfly charm. And underneath that is my coach tag, the tag that comes on the bag. So I just put the butterflies on that. And one thing that I really love is that the straps, they stay up. Unless you tuck them in for a storage, you can tuck them in, and that's that's perfect for me. I love that they stand up like that. Um, it is a, a good shoulder drop for me. I love it. This cutout helps uh, for it to fit right underneath. You know, perfect, perfect carry all. Um, it has the signature coach in the front, and then on the sides and in the middle, you have that. Um, is a glove tan leather is what they call it and I hate that whenever the only thing I don't like about coach now I know this I don't know if this has been going on I just didn't pay attention I like to go back and be able to um, like uh, copy the uh, the description of the bag and put it underneath for you guys but coach if it's sold out on coach they they take it away they take it down so I wasn't able to really get the details I wanted to get on the bag. I'm going to go try to see if I can find from like a retail store for you guys. Because um, I like to include that. Because um, I may miss something, you know. But this is the glove tan leather. This bag does have the zipper in the middle. And it has two zips. Unlike the Christie. The Christie has one. This has two zippers in the middle. Okay. And it has the magnetic closure on each side the front and the back okay on the back there is a zipper i didn't use it i didn't use it i could have fit my phone in there it goes down pretty deep but i didn't have to because i don't um i don't carry uh too much you know so this is a pretty substantial back pocket a big zipper pull and it is very um rough you know um, and I think that's because you just got to let you wear it enough and you unzip it and zip it enough. It'll, um, get loose in time. And I say that too, because I'm thinking about my, um, oh Lord. I'm thinking about my other tan rust bag that I bought second hand. Uh, it, it, I didn't have those problems with the zipper. The zipper was perfect, you know. Um, so I think over time that'll change but that is one thing i wanted to point out um i did not have to adjust the straps they were perfect the way they were but you can adjust them 
one, two, three holes you have. One, two, three holes. Okay. And so let's get into this bag. So I'm going to start with the front side. Well, let's start with the back side since I'm already here. So in the back, there is no pocket, okay? And it has this beautiful like suede burgundy material for the lining, y'all. I love it. So in the back, I have my coach pillowcase. case. I have my uh, card case, my tan rust card case, where I carry my ID and my most used cards in, okay? And I have my keys back here in my five grain key holder in the tan rust, okay? I'm gonna turn it around and let you guys see what I have in the front. Not very much, y'all. I don't carry a lot. So in the front, I have my lotion. My still carrying my gingham gorgeous lotion from my sis, and I also have my mirror, and that's from my sis too. Determined to be, and I have my Kleenex. I think that's. And in the front, I have a catch-all. It is my wristlet. Um, that's in tan rust and I, on it I have my uh, butterfly from my sister Miss T I think I'm going to just keep this on here this butterfly was made for this tan rust collection it is so pretty on here so inside of my catch all I just have a few things I have my uh, NYX lip gloss from my sister Miss T I have my gingham gorgeous hand sanitizer I have a few of my face wipes in there, my Neutrogena, because I have to keep those. Um, I have some perfume. This I have my uh, what is it? The uh, Clinique, uh Just uh, Be Happy. Is it Be Happy or My Happy? Okay. My Dior Addict um, Lip Maximizer. I decided to carry that this time. And that is it, y'all. That's all I have in here. And I keep my lotion out because uh, I use it a lot. My hand sanitizer, that's why I kept this in the front. Because I have my hand sanitizer in there. And if I wanted to, I could just leave this unzipped and dig right in, you know? If I just need to catch something real quick. But that's all I had in the front of my bag. I'm going to put this stuff right back in here. Well, you know what? I'm going to take it out so you guys can see the bag without anything in it. I don't remember if I showed it with my unboxing or not and I wanted you to see what it holds. So that is it for both sides. So we're going to go into the middle. Y'all, I absolutely love this bag. I feel like this bag almost, almost how I feel about the Sutton. And the Sutton is the bag that I was talking about that it had, it was uh, second hand. And see, now, one of my handbag sisters have this bag too. And that was their form that the zipper was so hard that they couldn't, the middle zip, they needed two hands to unzip it. You know, they needed two hands. And you do. You need two hands. So what I decided to do was make sure that whatever I put in this middle that I didn't need too often. And, and I didn't. I didn't have to pull it out at, uh, much at all. Um, I had my husband's in the middle part. Let me show you guys how it looks. I don't know if you can see that. In the middle, I'm going to bring this phone down. So in the middle, I just have my wallet in there and my pencil case, okay? So, and in the back pocket right here, I just have my husband's key. And I have a, um, I have a list. I still write things down on paper, y'all. Um, so this is the wallet that I carry. I forgot what they call this wallet, but this was on the reserve, coach reserve. And, uh, I got it at a good price, y'all. I was shocked. But it's the tan rust as well. 
and it snaps closed and open in this I have you know cash in here coins uh, some notes and bills and all my credit cards fit in here I absolutely love this wallet this is one of my favorite wallets I mean because you could just put so much in here they even have a back pocket so uh, and all in the last but not least I have my pencil case and see I don't pull this out too much because I mean I, I don't pull it out too much I, I, I have my main cards in my little case in my little card case and sometimes I'll even put coins and cash in the top of here so um, I didn't have to go in there that much so I have this and then I have my coach pencil case which is where I house some ink pens and I house my contact lens uh, stuff I put my contact lens case my three wet and drops extra pair of contacts and some ink pens and that's it y'all that is it that's all I had in the lottery show you guys That's her empty, except for my husband's key, um, and my uh, my little jot down, my little list sheet, and that snaps clothes in the back that pocket. So that is that, and if you guys can hear that magnetic closure, that now another thing that my uh, handbag sister that has his bag. She brought to my attention, she, you know, I don't know, I don't remember exactly what she had in the bag, but her magnetic closure uh, wasn't closing that well. And my, mine was good. Mine was good. It was good. Um, it, It's pulling now, you know, and of course I don't have anything in there now. So it's going to act up. It's going to act, you know, brand new. <laughs> but, um, you know, so... I, I did want to let you guys know about the uh, the things that, we, you know, might be a hassle for some people. Might not be, you know, something they want to get because of that, you know. So, but I, for me, this bag worked out perfect. This, this is on my list of bags that I did not want to get out of. Only reason I'm getting out of it is because I have other bags I need to wear. That is it. That is the only reason I am getting out. And that's on guard. Like the kids say. That, that's on guard, okay? That's on guard. Let me move this. That's on guard. So, I hope that you guys enjoy. I'm going to pack her back up because not quite ready to get out of her um i really enjoyed this carry if you guys have any questions or comments you know what i'm supposed to be putting this on the outside of the bag so y'all can see what's going on with me help me y'all help me 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 let me just put this out i'm gonna snap this So yeah guys, so this is um, my Lori in the tan rust. I hope that you guys enjoy. If you have any questions or comments, please don't uh, hesitate to put them down below. Thanks for watching. You guys have an awesome night. Bye-bye.